What if I told you one lick of peanut butter saved the lives of 60,000 children? For decades, doctors believed delaying allergic foods could prevent allergies. This concept started in the 1990s and early 2000s when the guidelines advised introducing peanuts and eggs only after the age of 2 or 3 years, thinking it would protect the immune system. But instead, peanut allergy skyrocketed, especially in the Western countries. Then came the landmark 2015 LEAP trial, learning early about peanut allergy. It studied high-risk infants with eczema, or egg allergy aged 4 to 11 months. One group avoided peanuts completely. The other group ate peanut-based foods. Not whole peanuts, but softened bamba puffs, thin peanut butter or peanut powder mixed into baby food. About 6 grams of peanut protein per week until the age of 5 years. At 5 years, peanut allergy was seen in only 3% of the peanut group versus 17% in the avoidance group and 80% reduction. That finding changed global policy. In 2017, the US NIAID, National Institute of allergy and infectious diseases reversed its stance, recommending early guided peanut introduction at 4 to 6 months. Since then, peanut allergy rates have dropped by nearly 40% and life threatening anaphylaxis has declined too. Bottom line, for nearly 30 years we were delaying peanut foods. But this one trial proved that early, safe exposure under medical guidance can actually prevent allergy itself.